Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Long Oak Farm. Your host, but not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Alright, I'm looking for Field 40. This is it. Got a contract we got to do. Spray some fertilizer on this field. And who we got? FRA. Okay, who that is. Uh, I gotta do some research on the names. I cannot seem to get it to work for me on 19. 17, I had everybody listed. But, uh, as you saw in the beginning, the hay's done turned to hay. And you should have seen a, a flyover with my drone that I did. So, uh, I hope y'all like that. It was something different. But, uh, I gotta find my baler, wherever it's at. Oh, I know where it's at. Alright, so I didn't know where it was at. It was on this side of my house, not on the barn side. But we gotta help her in the truck, and we're fixing to uh, get this thing going here. Let the bailer down. Let's start it up. Uh, one other thing we gotta do. And uh, we're gonna go north and south. All the way with uh, no offset. I like turning this on and off a couple times. It seems like it does better for some reason. I don't know why, but. Yeah, that would be offset. Not really offset, this different than what I had it in yesterday's episode. Alright, we're going about 18 mile an hour. Making 4,000 liter bales. Uh, these are mainly for the cows. But if we have any extra that I think that's going to be extra, we're going to sell them. Uh, but that'll be probably in spring. Um, I already got two trailers full, and plus what you see on the trailer now. Uh, I done them the last part of yesterday's episode, just make sure everything was running right. And today, all I got to do is make sure he's picking up right. We can see that, last, that first bell we made disappear onto the trailer, and I'll be happy. All right, we can rock and roll for a little bit. I need two more trailers like that for when we do far off, like up by the market shop and stuff like that. But folks, I'm already into the video, and I forgot to ask how y'all was doing. Y'all doing all right? <laughs> I'm freezing my booty off. Yeah, thought I was going to say something different, didn't you? I try to keep it kid friendly just in case. I missed a little bit over there, but I'll come back and get it. Okay, our sorry beans, folks. They're so ready for harvest almost. I'm actually thinking about going ahead and harvesting the corn to get a, a jump cut on it after we get this up. So, don't hold it to me. It might be in the next video. Might not. All depends. Is that trailer full yet? Uh, tow tunes, 38 bells, 39. It gets to 48, he'll be loaded, so. Maybe one went through. We're going to have quite a bit of hay. Because the other two trailers was a total of 48. Minus, well, actually 47. One of them was a grass bale. But I took it up to the sheeps. They didn't need nothing, so I'll just put it in their storage thing. But I got so much mods now, folks. I just, I need to make money so I can buy them. But I do have some good news. The guy at the dealership 
earlier this morning was telling me that he might have a demo for us. Uh, we'll go do some fall tillage or or whatever, you know. He might have a little surprise for us. So I don't know if it's going to be a piece of equipment or a tractor or something. But he did say fall tillage, so I don't, I don't know what that means. You, you think it might be a piece of equipment. Uh-oh. Truck's got a bale in front of him. Oh, he just ran over the bale. Okay, we got to stop this. We could probably have to go unload anyway. Uh, it's hard to find good help. Oh, okay. God, that truck needs a bath. We loaded, yep, yeah, because he ain't picking up none. Come back here. You're loaded. You're loaded, baby. You're loaded. Get that truck. Where Sanders should be driving. Um. Oh, okay. I can sure. Ah, right, back trailer needs to be. Transport mode. And folks, I will meet y'all at the uh, bail storage point. See you in a second. All right. The cows probably think it's feeding time. Not quite, ladies. Not quite. Well, our solids has to turn before uh, I can give them TMR. I keep forgetting about that. And we'll check it while we're here. All right. And take it out across there. Pull up this into the line right here. And drop. Bingo. Switch into the back. We'll move it over. And it's going to pull up. Well, I think it's in the boundary and bingo. Was his name Mo? Put it back on the front. We're going to hop out to see how many hay bales we do have and check our sellage bales, see how much they got. I like how they stack it so neat. 116 bales we can do probably another good load can't we around about all right so 536,000 liters i can work with that I, wait what did i say there's no free space oh okay the vehicle's blocking <laughs> gotcha folks it's been a uh, one heck of a morning I had a low tire. I had to get it aired up. Alright, we got 155 bells. 168 is capacity, so ain't too far off. 740,000 liters. And the remaining time, my X button will work. Um, there ain't nothing in there. I guess they're all sellage. They don't have no remaining time, no percentage, so. Cool. We can make TMR now. Okay. Um, but yeah, we had a low tire this morning. And uh, I realized it's. What was it? Let me pull that up real quick while I'm thinking about it. It's November the 12th, Tuesday. And tonight it's supposed to get 16. And right now it's showing 21 degrees. So I'm recording this at 8.44 a.m. 
So there's a magic. It probably was about 19 degrees this morning at 6:30 or 6 o'clock. They left at 6:30. Mom came back to the house. I well, I stayed here. Mom and the kids went, and uh, when she got back, I think she went by a store or two because she got back like I think eight o'clock. She shut the van off for a little bit, and she forgot, left her lights on, so I had to boost her off. And, uh, yeah, now I'm making a video for y'all. Alright, I'm going to get this guy back behind the baler. we got to get some more bales picked up. Let's see here, I think. X. Go back to the oven, and get X. I'm trying to do this while I open the drop down menu. I should know the buttons by heart as much I play this. I really ain't been playing that much. Only thing I've been playing is like trying to speed time up and stuff. So I'm doing woodwork in between. Like, uh. I think it was Ice Demon? Damon? Demon? Uh. What was it he said? The lumberjack is back. So I'm gonna have to put that comment in. Uh, uh oh, I almost made a boo boo. Almost made a boo boo. Back up a little bit. Hit Control F, and it sets my distance there. 45 behind, and 2.5 to the right offset. I'm gonna increase that to 35. Or decrease it, I mean. Folks, I am so happy that harvest is just right around the corner. Actually, to be truthful, we're harvesting now. It's just a different type. All right. Yeah, there, there, there we go. Who did I... Really? Betty got back in that vehicle? Ooh, and our fertilizer rig is almost done. So let me do a little bit more of this, and I'm going to take that fertilizer buggy over to the other field and get a worker started over there. I think it's... I got several contracts I got to do on fertilizing. Let's just hop in here a little bit. Betty's probably like, will you stop looking at your PDA? All right, that is getting scary. Auto saves taking a little bit longer than I want. We have uh, 51, we're in 40, 72% done, 15 and 43. That's why I ain't worried about my money too much, because 16, that's 26, 38, and plus another 8, well, almost 9, time you add all the change up. So, yeah, that's... <sighs> We're going to get there. Only thing that I might have to do is sell maybe a little bit of corn and, and a lot of the sunflowers or whichever one's going the most money to sell to get a header so we can do the soybeans. So I might have to just buy one header and you know, one combine might be just not running but But what I'm thinking about doing, oh, I'm so close to the end here. Um, what I'm thinking about doing is filling the hay thing up, which won't take very much more, and then putting enough bales back to do probably two or three loads of TMR, and whatever's left, sell. Uh, might not sell them right away, but as soon as the money gets right. Alright, so that one trailer is already full almost. Let's jump in here real quick and take a look at our prices on uh, hay and sullage. They're probably going to be down, but hay is going up. Look at the difference. Biogas plant. 
the same place. Sullage is not very much. But then you got hay. Look at the price of hay. So I, I think we're going to sell some hay instead of making sullage. I'm going to have to figure that up. Sell exactly 50 bales one day. And not doing nothing until we see the, our paycheck. And figure out if it's right or not. Oh, 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 oh. How did I shut that off? Dang, baby. You getting on down, ain't you? All right. Well, folks, uh, yeah, let me uh, get right back with y'all. I'm going to get that fertilized buggy, and I'll be right back. All right, this is uh, the third load. And I think I need to come in from that way and go around instead of, you know, come through here other way. Because this way is kind of hard to make that turn. Yeah. Anyway. I'm going to drop this off. And it, it looks like it's getting pretty tall. Let's see. I'm going to put that back. And switch to our other one. And drop it off. Oh, whoa, what? I hit the wrong button. All right, I gotta have my thing on up here. Come on. Switch to the Xbox controls. There we go. Unload car A. Load car. Oh, I'm on. Duh. No wonder it wasn't working. Ooh, that's a tall stack. I need to turn my figure, I mean, my uh, camera speed up a little bit. That is a pretty tall stack. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let go one more. Oh, we're four bales away. 728,000. So we'll fill, we'll bring probably one trailer over here. There'll be four bales in it. And plus, uh, well, I still need another thing till price goes up. So we'll probably end up buying one of these, putting it somewhere temporary. So I really don't know where. I, I really don't know where to put it. I guess out by my yard somewhere. Hmm. We had all three of these filled up. That'd be awesome. All right. Put that back in transport mode. And try to get out of here without getting hung up. And uh, we'll be right back with the beller, folks. All right, when you unload the truck and this happens. Didn't get close enough, folks. Let's see if I can be He-Man one more time. Yeah, some of it worked. All right, I'm on. By the way, this is a muscle mod. Uh, I think couple up. If I can find it, I'm gonna put that tag in. Uh, something about the tree, how I can lift it. Must be a strong player because I can lift a tree or something like that. It'll be in the comment. Uh, yeah, it's it's a muscle mod I'm using. Uh, it's actually called Lift Anything Mod. Is what it's called. And you basically can lift just about anything. So, uh, yeah, I am kind of being unrealistic right now. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's fun. Hee ho! Woohoo! Oh, wow. The trigger needs to be the, that whiff across instead of top. Is that three points? Let's do it again. 
Whee! That goes right back in the same spot. Kick it. There we go. It never hurts to have a little fun. You gotta know when to have fun and when not to have fun. It's like, uh, what is it, Kenny Rogers? Gotta know when to hold them. Got to know when to fold them. Oh, wait. I'm about to stop before I get copyrighted or something. All right. Well, it's two loads right there. I need four bales to put back there, and that'll be full. Uh, these here is going to be for, well, they're all going to be for TMR, but ones uh, we don't use to be up here, ones we think we need to sell. And just give you a quick idea of what I got left. I got one complete through and a little bit down there. Then I'll be on the short rows. So, uh, yeah. Let's see. I gotta put this thing back in operating position. Let's see. That and that should do it. Switch to the front. Fold it back. And then put it in operation mode and it should pick them up now and uh, folks uh you might notice my money jumped from negative 300 to seven plus i don't want the contract so i could put that hay pad down which was uh what 150 dollars i think so to go in and look i got serious field 51, 40, 43, and 15. So that's done. I'm working on 43 now. It's 39% done. Let's say 40, 39. 39% done. And that is this pretty close to us. He's going to be needing some help here soon. So I might have to go down there and help him. But I'll going to get back with it and uh, I will see y'all in a little bit for an update and another two loads tell you what this field made some hay or two fields I should say hope I get over far enough oh not quite okay we'll switch to the back And move over. Bam. Okay. Just have to push him in. We'll get him on the next three. Alright. Come on. Get out of my way. Come on. There you go. Rounding it up to the last bit, folks. Got our last fertilized contract going, which I think should be field 15. Uh, Miss Sandra's up there. She's working on field 15. That's her last one. And this is all we got right here. I guess it would be a whole lot less if I had to watch what I'm doing. I can usually take about six sloths, three on each side of the tractor like I'm doing, if it's all mowed just right. And in the last episode, I said this is going to be a shed area, which it might be. Well, I know it's going to be, I just don't know it's going to be an open shed or, you know, like this a lean tube, just something uh, tractors can pull under, or a closing shed. I'm um, actually thinking both. Uh, need somewhere to put the headers and stuff. They just need to be under something where, you know, the rain stuff won't get on them. But they kind of need to be in an open because that way critters and stuff won't. Um, how can I say it? Usually when you have a closed in shed. And you got something in there. Critters likes to make nests and stuff in it, like squirrels and raccoons and stuff. And if it's out in the open during the winter time, 
and they, they most likely won't do it because it's you know it's still out in the cold but it's not getting rained on or snowed on or direct sunlight and stuff like that and so I can't remember how many bells we had when we started no it wasn't very many oh I can wait a minute I get done I can go in here and look how many bells we done today unless my help thing has that on there it usually does uh, press bells and total bells 667 that can't be right I'll go in the HUD here in a second. All right. Oh, I still got one in here. Shut that off. And we'll just press that null out. There we go. Lift that up. And fold. And buddy, that's your last bell. Just a total of 19. Not bad, not bad at all. Let's see, Miss Sanders, uh, a little over a quarter, almost half. That feel probably I'll probably need to go do that one thumb looking deal that's sticking out there around fourteen. So folks, um, let's get a total real quick. We're going to need to turn that off before I get in trouble. All right. What screen is that going to be? Uh, this one? No, that's the money. And that's not that. One. This one? Uh, time played. Workers currently hired is two. Storage capacity is zero. Okay. Trees cut down, 640 total. Created bells, 186. So we got 186 bells off of these two fields, this one and this one. Bringing us a total all together, 620 bells. Oof. And all this, you can pause it and look, but gives you the seed fertilize fuel driving distance harvest time uh, you know just all this other stuff so yeah and uh, she's 37 percent done with that let's go ahead and take this and then collect it 16,000 and look like that's all going I might do some of these well, there's a bailing right there. Uh, make solids bales. We got the stuff to do that, but and there is money. You get eight, almost nine thousand plus whatever bales is left. Ten and fourteen. Ten and fourteen. Where's ah? Damn. Zoom out. Gonna be up towards the top. There's ten. And there's fourteen. Why would it have to be so far away? Hmm. We might do them, I don't know. Wish twenty two would come available. I wouldn't mind buying twenty two. 316,000. 28 is what I'm thinking about going next. 405,000. But I'm thinking about 28 for sure. That way we'll own this whole big block here. So that's, that's still a lot of money. I still owe the bank. Speaking of the bank, 2.1. <laughs> Let's go ahead and repay some of this. About right there, because I need to buy some more fertilizer in case we have. But it won't take long to get that down. It, it just it won't. So, folks, I'm gonna wrap it up here. 
and put these bales in storage to that price. Oh, that's what I was going to look at. The price of the hay is going up at bale sale point. But don't tell me what the price is. So right now, oh, I imagine that price is uh, way down. So biogas plant. One thousand two hundred ninety-five and ninety-eight cents. Trying to figure. Out. I think I know how I figured that up. But we got what was one hundred and sixty bales times four thousand. Then you take that and times this, and you should get the price tag, right? Anyway, I'm gonna figure that up off screen. And next episode will be selling some bales and also um, hopefully harvesting corn. Let's go around and check that out real quick. I know you probably hate these long ones but next episode or two if we get in a harvest they're gonna be really really okay right here we are. Uh, the sunfire is actually planted first Oh, I don't need a chainsaw. 100% uh, thirteen moisture. That can go right now. Corn. Thirteen hundred percent. I see nine percent at the bottom. Okay, those two are the same. Let's run over here to this other field we accumulated. Okay, it's not fertilized all the way, but other than that, ground moisture is 9% and plant moisture is 13%. Folks, I think we're going to be harvesting in the next episode. Ooh. And, uh, oh, that's, uh, our truck scared us. I parked the truck down there and oh, we got a little corn right here on the end where I messed up. You know what? All this corn reminds me of children of the corn. Let's see if I can go around and around and around. Uh oh. Now let's get myself lost. Oh no! Oh, right there, folks. I saw the grass. I cheated. I cheated! But anyway. I love each and every one of y'all folks. Y'all are awesome. Don't let nobody tell you different. Y'all are totally, totally awesome. So, I hate to leave y'all, but I gotta go. That'll be alright. I'll be back in the next episode. Selling some bells. And see what we're gonna get from midnight for them. Might go ahead and sell them today. That way tomorrow y'all know what we'll get from. <laughs> All right, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all in the next episode. Don't forget to hit that like button if you feel like it's worthy of a like. And uh, also that bell. And don't forget to share me with your friends. I love y'all folks. See y'all later. Bye.